you know what? Time flies, doesn't it? Because I was just thinking a year ago, I was planning my wedding. Just a year ago. <laughs> and a year from now, I will be finished paying for it. <laughs> but it really does, it flies. It's almost summer. It's almost summer. Can you see the signs of it everywhere? <laughs> are getting shorter, tops are getting tubier. <laughs> and the big summer movies are about to come out. There's the one with Ben Stiller, of course. Yeah! Night of the <laughs> that looks good. And the one with Shia LaBeouf, Transformers 2. Yeah! And you see, that's what happens when there's a big successful movie and everybody loves it. They make a sequel. And that's why this summer, Disney is still not putting out a sequel to Finding Nemo. <laughs> I don't know what kind of Mickey Mouse or, uh, operation they're running over there. <laughs> so if you're going to go to the movies this summer, I have two tips to help you enjoy the great summer movies that aren't Finding Nemo 2. <laughs> I call them Ellen's two tips to help you enjoy all the great summer movies that aren't Finding Nemo 2. <laughs> All right. <laughs> there you go. All right. These are my seats. I bought these after I made Mr. Wrong. These are uh, all the people that saw the movie in the theater. So I. All right. There's nothing. All oh, your hair looks really nice, Kevin. <laughs> that was smart, Andy, to put a hat on. All right, there's nothing worse than waiting in line for your refreshments and possibly missing nine of the previews. So, here's my tip. Don't waste time and money at the concessions. Wait for the lights to dim, and then... If you get really good at it, you can grab a raisinette. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or even a watch. <laughs> like I said, you have to get really good at it. Anyway. One of the biggest summer movies is Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince. Now, kids are excited because it's the second to last Harry po Potter movie. And adults are excited because it's the second to last Harry Potter movie. <laughs> but before you see the movie, you have to buy the book. Where's the book? All right. Because, not to read it or anything like that, <laughs> but to sit on, because most likely, Because if you go see that movie, most likely you're going to be sitting behind a guy with a giant wizard hat. So you can... <laughs> All right. And also, it may look like an ordinary Harry Potter book, but it also is a transformer because... Look at this. You can sneak it in. There. That's my magic potion. It's magic because if you drink of an, enough of it, you really turn into a good dancer. Bye.